initial reaction to it? Good, bad, indifferent? Yeah, I mean, it, it was huge. Right? After the Foxborough loss, you know, the kids, the kids, you know, at that first quarter, you know, when they went up the way they did, you know, we didn't know if uh, if we were going to have another Foxborough game or not. Uh, but uh, the kids the kids just showed their mettle. They, they played great in the, in, the, uh, in the second quarter. It's obviously Cohasset gets out of the league. How did you guys respond there? I mean, I think they did a great job. You know what I mean? We just pecked away at them one, one at a time, and uh, they just, you know, they came through in a big way. But, uh, what can you say about Sedetti's goal that he scored down here? Just an impossible angle and hits a post and goes in. You know, you know we're, we're saying give it up, give it up, give it up, and then we're going, oh my God, what an un unbelievable goal. You know, he's just, he's been doing it for four years. He's been doing it for four years. The offense definitely, I mean, second quarter, third quarter, is that just settling into the game plan better? Or did the defense shift on collapses that you guys saw? Uh, I think that what happened was uh, we started to extend out on them. Uh, the defense did. You know, I just, I, I didn't feel comfortable with them having a real comfort level and allowing them to, you know, just cycle the ball and look for, to run through their offense. So we started to extend, and I think that they paid dividends. Awesome. Who's up uh, next for you guys? We have Dover Sherbin on Monday. Yeah. What, what can you guys do better, sort of, at least in the first quarter to start the game going forward? Uh, you know, I mean, we threw away a lot of balls uh, at times. I just feel as though we, we weren't mentally and physically prepared to start off, but then they, you know, they just they just did a great job after that. All right, boys. Slow start. What do you think caused that? Um. Is that a trend for you guys or is something new today? Yeah, it's definitely been something that we've kind of noticed throughout the year, but uh, we knew today was definitely going to be a big game, so we, we knew we needed a win, especially after our loss uh, on Wednesday. So we knew once we went down by three, we needed to come back. We needed to dig down deep and just get a few goals to get back in the game. Yeah, that loss from Foxborough really got to our heads pretty bad. I mean, we knew we had to come out and win. Playoffs are, what, two or three it's games away. No, we got to step it up for playoffs, and you know that was step one of getting ready for it. So from there we go. Yep. So obviously, I mean that's that's got to be tough. How do you get back up for a game two days later after a crushing overtime loss like that in Foxborough? Um, pretty much exactly. We just, I mean, we're definitely a family, yeah. so we definitely know we got to have each other's back. And when it comes to a game like this where we know playoffs are close and we don't want our seed to be dropping, and we need we need these statement wins like this uh, team like Cohasset, you know, they're very good. So we yeah. knew we needed this statement win. Definitely a good practice a day after too. Yesterday we had a quick practice, but we got stuff done. Yeah. I mean, we had to come out flying. We knew what was at stake, so. Uh, Eric, you scored a couple of just ridiculous goals tonight. I mean, that, this one down here, like, we were talking in the booth. I have no idea how you scored it. Take me through that one where you sniped it lock. Uh, the shot? Yeah. Um, def they just gave me the room. I mean, I knew... I mean, we needed a goal there, so I, I kind of just stepped back and let it rip, man. Yeah. And then back down this end, the double, double spin move. Is that just, like, spur of the moment, or are you... Been working on that? Is that a uh, no, definitely not something so, definitely not something to work on. Just definitely it just came to me and uh, just made a quick few quick moves and you know, got my hand screen shot it. How fast do you shoot? Because it looks like <laughs> pretty fast. fast. <laughs> when I get when I get going, I mean once I get heated up, I can definitely put it in the back of the net. But I just got to be in my spot to shoot. Did they? Did you guys like adjust at all second quarter, third quarter when that offense really started to click, or was it something they kind of gave you? Uh, yes, definitely. I mean, uh, we noticed kind of they were pinching down low on us, especially when uh, we were dodging from X. So we wanted to make sure we were hitting those uh, skip lanes from X up, up, yeah. up high. And we're leaving the top open quite a bit. So I mean, we made use of what they gave us, and we finished with it. Yep. What did you? Uh, what did you guys see from your defense? Obviously, down the other end of the field, but your D and MIDI play really started to pick up as well. How did those guys help you? Yeah. Um, I mean, they've like held down. The defensive side all year. I mean, they're a great uh, defensive unit. And, uh, I mean, they definitely can take the ball when we need it. I mean, we've got our great goalie in there who definitely makes some big saves throughout every game. Yeah. Another good opponent in Dover Sherborne. Absolutely. Coming in, or are you guys going there? Uh, coming in, I think. think. Yeah. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. What can you guys do even better to get over that kind of slow start you had tonight? Yeah, I think exactly that. Yeah. We just got to make sure that we come out flying. I mean, it's another huge game for us, so we got to make sure we start off fast, because once we start off fast, I mean, I'm pretty sure yeah. Yeah. we can We've been playing against a kid going to UNC on DS for like three years now, and I mean, they're without him now. He was really their whole team, so hopefully we can make something happen without him there, but our defense is definitely what keeps us in all those good games. Yep. Awesome. Harris, Betty, Chase, Dana, thank you, boys.